money is so emotional that really you're you're part psychologist too because you're they bring their their people's worst behavior as well as their worst fears come out when it comes to money and losing money because it's such an emotional subject. Why do you think that financial advising, estate planning, your wealth, you know, planning is the, is the greatest job? Um, not to be uh, negative, but there's so many people in this business that do it badly <laughs> that, yeah. that you really just that, that you really you, you don't have to have all the answers. No one. No one does. I certainly don't pretend to. Um, but you it, it's just a matter of. I can't think of anything more rewarding. I, this is stupid, but as a kid in downtown Toledo, my, my dad, my dad was a mechanical engineer, but we always did a lot of physical labor and stuff on the, you know, we worked all the time. And I remember driving through downtown Toledo, which is like one of the fastest shrinking cities in the country. And I saw this guy in a suit going into one of these buildings. I'm like, dad, what do these people do? Like, what, and, 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 you know, he's trying to explain it. I'm like, you know, one day I just want to be a guy that goes into a, within a suit into a building and gets to do whatever they do. And that was, I was like, I don't know, six years old. And yeah. so I didn't even know what that meant, but it's, I, as an advisor, you, you do a lot of things, but I feel like it, what, what's, what makes it best is the hardest part about my job is that you internalize all of the, the most intense fears that your clients have. So it, when everything's going up, it's great. Everybody feels great, right. but money is so emotional that really you're, you're, part psychologist too because you're they bring their their people's worst behavior as well as their worst fears come out when it comes to money and losing money because it's such an emotional subject and i get i i love money i love markets i love seeing how the gears work inside of an engine yeah. and a motor how the the gears work in the ipo process the spac process the the how the whole thing actually works and and, and why markets matter and why investing matters and how it can absolutely transform someone's life um, by just, they don't have to do super complicated things, but just by doing a couple key things right. And, and so when, when clients refer me to, to, to their friends, their family, or when they come back, you know, I've, I've been, you know, now 10 years, I've had clients with me that are now for 10 years and they're, you know, they, they, they either cross that million dollar mark or that $2 million mark, $3 million. And then they're like, Oh, we, we can retire, but we want to keep working. You know, that, um, I've always, I grew up with an anxiety about money, the fear of not having money because I realized to be able to see my family, to travel to see and do, do all the things and go snowboarding whenever I want be able to, you know, help my family and friends when I need to, it's money. So I've always wanted to learn how to invest and make, Yeah, and that, um, yeah, absolutely.